Hey, it's Joe with GeekTire.com. I am here at CinemaCon 2024 in Las Vegas with Billy Fisher. <laughs> we just went to the Lionsgate presentation where they showed us a brand new extended trailer for the upcoming Eli Roth directed movie Borderlands, which is the big screen adaptation of the hit video game that lots of people love. Right. A lot of people love the game. Um, and hopefully they'll love the movie. It looks like it's going to be a lot of fun. It looks like it'll be fun. Uh, they showed this great trailer with a lot of crazy action-packed footage. Uh, if you saw the first trailer, then you know there was a lot of comparing this movie to James Gunn's Guardians of the Galaxy. And this new trailer didn't do that any favors of like kind of going away from that. Instead, they kind of leaned into it and they're like, yeah. This is, like, we want you to have that Guardians of the Galaxy kind of feel to it. Right. Which it totally it does. does. I mean, the song playing through the tr trailer is Come Sail Away, and it's just like... It's got a lot of action. It is going to be bloodier than Guardians. We pretty much saw that. Sure, this yeah. Is Eli it's going to be It's going to be violent, and that's Lots cool. That's smashing. cool. So. Yeah, but it, it was fun. I, I'm excited to go see it. Um, the cast is fantastic. You, know, you got Kate Blanchett, you Kate got Blanchett. Uh, Jamie Lee Curtis, Kevin Hart, Jack Black. You're looking at a pretty amazing cast doing what amazing casts do. They uh, they pull off the roles. They're funny. It looks yeah, it looks action good. Packed, they so. fight these giant tentacled monsters in the trailer. I mean, look if you played the game, you kind of know what you're getting yourself into. If you've watched Guardians of the Galaxy. You kind of know what you're getting yourself into. Just kind of put just those a together. Bit, just a little more violent, I guess. Yeah. Um, Eli Roth came out on stage, talked a little bit about the movie, talked about how he fought tooth and nail to get this because he's such a big fan of the game. Uh, when he left to shoot Thanksgiving, the movie needed a ton of reshoots, and they brought in Deadpool director Tim Miller to come in and do all that. And there's like a lot of stuff, you know, a lot of behind the scenes kind of like rumors and drama that the movie was in trouble, that it needed help, uh, that the writer didn't want to have his name attached to it, stuff like that. But in the end, it just seems like it's a fun, playful, silly adaptation of Borderlands. And it just, it looks like the game. So if you're a fan, I don't see why you wouldn't enjoy it. Exactly. It looks like a lot of fun. Um, I'm just going to forget that there was all the controversy before, and I'm just going to go into this with what we just saw and with a new mindset. Like, this is going to be yeah, a lot of fun. I just hope that the movie delivers a good story. We know that the actions, the visual, all that stuff is there. So let's just hope they manage to, like, nail that story and the script. Right. But with a cast like that and just the property that they're working with, they've got something special on their hands. So hopefully they pull it off. Excited about watching it. Uh, that movie comes out on August 9th. Thank you for watching this video. Continue to watch our videos because we've got, got more coming. Until next time, see you at the movies.